All right, GP Lester, man. Matthew van der Poel is leading out the bunch and he lost his handlebar. So we're going to get into the details because obviously it was a bit weird. He was like riding along on the hoods and then his handlebars goes flying off and he starts holding onto the tops. So I was like, oh, maybe he's trying to get error. But anyway, as you can see here, we'll bring up the old laser pointer and uh, we will be able to see what the issue is. So you can see just here where my laser pointer is, this is the bit of handlebar that flew off. It's on the left hand side. It's a grainy footage, so we can't see too much. But if we go to the next one, you can see this is the this is the finish. And at first I was like, I thought it had split here where my where my ass is there, because underneath that they basically have like um the handlebar can slide in and out. So it's like that's the handlebar. It can basically slide in and out depending on how wide you want the handlebars. But it didn't fail there. It actually failed further down, which is a bit more interesting. Uh, but maybe more sort of obvious because you'd actually be pulling down on the bar from that point. But I think that one of the best sh shots is actually here. As you can see, the shift has just completely fallen off. Um, and if we really try and zoom in uh, just on this particular point here, uh, we'll try that again. Um, so you can see like the where my mouse is now, the, the shift is just like sort of connected just by the DI2 wires and hot, sort of flying around. And it's actually the bottom bit of the bar that's fallen off, which is really, really bad because Canyon, like they've had a lot of issues with this bike. First of all, the bottom bracket didn't work properly. It took them ages to sort that out. Like you saw the Canyon Aero like two years ago, but they couldn't sort out the cable room with the bottom bracket. Then they had the seat post issue, which obviously um, probably watch Hambini's or Peak Talk videos. They've got videos somewhere about um, the issue with the seat post that basically just like starts frayeding away. And now they've got this handlebar issue, which looks really pretty serious because I mean, these bikes, which pros ride generally, they inspect probably a lot more than what amateurs do. Okay, they do more Ks, but even so. Um, but yeah, it looks like it's just completely short, sh uh, sheared off um, under the shifter, because um, you think the shifter was there, just fallen off uh, underneath. And just, yeah, not really not really something you want to see in a race. Um, Vanderpool held up pretty well, just cold in the middle of it. Um, but yeah, that, that seems to be the issue. Uh, if you've got Canyon Handlebar, I was... I'd recommend to check it quite carefully because don't want that to happen. Okay, they did ride over cobbles, so maybe it's not too bad. But this new Canyon Aero is definitely not turning out to be the publicity marketing machine that they thought it was going to be uh, with Vanderpoel winning Lesser Man. Instead, no one actually cares about Tim Merlier, who won. It was a really good sprint. Obviously, you could show you footage, but you as well have it. Uh, but yeah, it was a really good sprint. But instead, the, the headline of Cycling Weekly uh, was this. The Vanderpoel doesn't have a, ha a right ha a shifter on his bike anymore. It's just suspended due to DI2 batteries, uh, so D DI2 wires. Uh, so yeah, that is the news of the day. Um, but anyway, cheers for watching. Hope you did enjoy. Obviously, leave your comments below about what you thought could be the reason. Maybe it was the cobbles. Maybe it was, you know, just sh faulty, you know, delamination in the rim, etc., etc. It could be a lot of reasons. Uh, me personally, probably was something to do with cobbles and sprinting and just a bit dodgy. Um, maybe crashed on it and they didn't check, etc. etc. But yeah, leave your comments below what you think it could be the cause. Um, and yeah, I think it's the first time I've ever seen a handlebar snap like that before. Um, but yeah, so here's what it is. Anyway, cheers for watching. See you in the next one, eh?